Welcome to Electron Online. How can we tell if two lines are parallel to one another or perpendicular to one another? Or neither. They're neither parallel or perpendicular. Well, let's read these two statements. It says two lines are parallel if and only if the slopes are equal to each other. What do we mean by the statement if and only if? Well, if we only were to say that two lines are parallel if the slopes are equal, then there may be other conditions for which they would qualify as being parallel as well, other than the slopes being equal, but that's not the case. So when we say if and only if, there is no other way in which two lines can be parallel unless the two slopes are equal to one another. So here we have examples of two lines, line A, line B, the slope of A is 2, the slope of B is 2, you can see that the two slopes are equal to each other and therefore by definition if and only if the two slopes are equal therefore the two lines must be parallel. In the case over here notice we have two lines C and D. The slope of C is 2 and the slope of D is negative 1 half. The statement says that two lines are perpendicular if and only if, so it's not just if, but the only condition that can qualify the two lines as being poplar, uh, perpendicular, not poplar, but perpendicular, uh, means that if and only if the slopes are equal to each other. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. I jumped to the wrong line. Let me try this again. It says two lines are perpendicular if and only if the slope of one is the negative inverse of the slope of the other. So, in other words, if the slope of one equals negative one over the slope of the other, then the two lines are perpendicular. Now, if they're not equal, and if one is not equal to the negative inverse of the other, then they're not parallel, nor are they perpendicular. Then there's some other angle between the two. But in this case, you can see that the slope of one is equal to negative one over the slope of the other. Another way of saying it is that if you multiply the two slopes together and you get negative 1, then they're perpendicular because then 1 is the negative inverse of the other. So here you can see, if you take 2 and multiply times minus 1 half, what do you get? 2 multiplied times negative 1 half, you get indeed negative 1. That means that they are perpendicular to one another. And that's what we mean by lines that are parallel and lines that are perpendicular to one another. 